From one terrible area to <coughs> another da dangerous area. Here, as I said during the introduction, they wouldn't give you food, no water, no light, no air, till you drop dead. What was the offense? You fought for your freedom. And they said you were stopped. Three days ago, you fought an officer. Yesterday, you did. And just this morning, you are therefore a thorn in their flesh. Remember, they had branded them already so they could easily be identified. You were a big woman, big man of your own in your village. All of a sudden, you were reduced to a slave. God is still with those things we saw over there. How will you contain it? <laughs> Officer came before you, instructing you to do another thing or one thing or another. Already, in the Queen's language, you did not understand. You were angry. What would you have done to that officer? So there was some who you the shadows. Yeah. 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 One of the oldest paintings we have in this castle is this door a little over two centuries. Pitch pine wood, copper on it, giving it strong protection. The middle and the last doors removed. And remember, before Accra became the capital of Gold Coast, first it was Cape Coast and the seat of government right in this castle until 1877, 141 years ago, following political and economic reasons. Later, we'll also talk briefly about the grapes, water system, work on the town, and then we'll move on to female dances. Now we're going to have another ceremony here, one after the other. Which one more? Mm -hmm. We're going what yeah. in what your, what the condemned cell. Condemned cell. Yeah. Yeah. And so, so these are these are our ancestors who were fought for their freedom in the castle, and but they, they never won the battle because of the treatment. No food for you, no water to drop you. So they created this to serve as a lesson or deterrent to other captives. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Watch your head. Watch your head. Let's form a circle.
let's pay a hoban to our ancestors. At least. Thank you. 